four years, I have struggled to know how to love my brothers and sisters in Christ who experience homelessness, those who live on the streets. I've always been kind of worried about my safety. I'm a single female. I'm, I, I don't want to get hurt. I'm not sure if I should give them money. I've just been confused for years, but also for years I've been praying about this, asking God and asking other people for help on what to do because I know it's essential to love my brothers and sisters in Christ. Jesus commands us to love the poor, to love the vulnerable, to love those on the margins of society. It's literally a condition for entering into heaven. What we do to the least of our brothers that we do into Jesus. And I don't love these people because I wanna get into heaven. I love these people because I love Jesus and Jesus commands me to. So for years I've struggled how to do this and I just wanna share some glory. There is a man who begs outside of my church for months. He has approached me and he's approached others asking for money. He tells me a story and I listen and I'm like, man, that's like so hard. What is your name? He tells me his name is Frank. I say, Frank, thank you for telling me, Frank. I am praying for you. I don't have any cash on me because I don't carry cash on me. I say, but Frank, I do have water and I do have granola bars in my car. Would you would you like some of that? And he always says yes. So I go to my car and it's in full daylight in a church parking lot. There's, there's other people around and I give Frank the water. I give him the granola bars and I say, Frank, I am praying for you. He's like, okay, great, thank you. So this has happened for a month. So it happened again today as I was leaving church. I see Frank, he approaches me and I wave and I say, Frank, hey, great to see you. How are you? And he's, he's startled. And I'm like, what, what's wrong? Are you okay? And he's like, I just I just can't believe you remember my name, that you always remember my name. I'm like, yeah, Frank, I, I pray for you. I think about you. So I offer him water and I offer him granola bars again. And, and we chat a little bit. And before we go, he, you can tell he's like a little shaken. He says, I just can't believe you remember my name. I just can't believe you remember my name. And I just wonder how many times a day, a week, a month, someone remembers this man's name. In this moment, he felt seen, he felt known, hopefully he felt loved. And this isn't to say like, I'm great, I'm amazing. This is to give glory to God. And this is to thank God for the gift of the Holy Spirit to inspire this interaction. And I just think of how Jesus knows me by name. He's called me by name. He sees me, he knows me, he loves me, he identifies me by my name. When we can do this for other people, those on the streets, those around us in our community, we're able to love them and bring the love of Jesus Christ to them. So pray for Frank, pray for the people in your community who are experiencing homelessness, and be bold. Bring the love of Jesus Christ to them.